Andrew Malkinson's bumpy road to freedom just got a little smoother. He won't be charged for board and lodging during his 17 years in prison. Until now, other wrongly convicted prisoners have had to pay. I think it's yeah. quite abhorrent. Um, whoever invented that, um, God knows, but um, it's a very silly, very vindictive, actually. It comes across as vindictive. Ridiculous piece of legislation that's completely unnecessary. I thought that's so terribly bad, it's, it's quite unbelievable, and I'm sure the public think the same way, and clearly they do. Justice Secretary Alex Chalk said, fairness is a core pillar of our justice system, and it is not right that victims of devastating miscarriages of justice can have deductions made for saved living expenses. This common sense change will ensure victims do not face paying twice for crimes they did not commit. The House of Lords introduced the rule that appeared to punish the innocent in 2007. Ever since then, convicted prisoners who later establish their innocence and win compensation have been liable to have the amount docked to reflect the savings they've made on living expenses. Two men, Vincent Hickey and his cousin Michael Hickey, had their convictions lifted for the murder of newspaper boy Carl Bridgewater, but still saw their compensation docked. It's, it's an extraordinary step to take to effectively punish someone twice. They've been in prison against their will, wrongly, and that's recognised by the state, and yet the fact they've been in prison counts against them. Whatever official compensation he gets, it will be capped by law at a million pounds. It sounds perhaps like to the average layperson like a lot of money, but that represents nearly two decades of living hell and lost opportunities and lost love and uh, everything else that makes life precious is all just a big void of, of, of unhappiness. Mr Malkinson still has the right to sue for damages. Greater Manchester Police, the force who arrested and questioned him. Martin Brunt, Sky News, Westminster.